Hello everybody, it's Chippy Jenny here and today I'll be showing you how to make these candy cube fruit felt needles. Here are the materials. I bought these sponges from Amazon and they sold in a big pan but they are really cheap. As you can tell it's very squishy so you can even use this for squishy toys. So I divided this sponge by 6 into 6 cubes. It doesn't have to be perfect, you can just use scissors or cutter, just cut them into little squares. I do make some smaller size and I do make some bigger size. Now you can use any colors of woods you want. I'm gonna make this light brown because I want to make it like a chocolate candy cube. So just tear some woods apart and just spread them around the cube. The good thing about these sponges are very easy to work with. All you need to just do a little poke and then the wood will just go inside it. Now this is very simple. All you need to do is just keep poking and just cover the whole cube with your woods that you like. Just be careful when you are doing this part because the cube is small, so take your time so you don't poke yourself. If you run out of wood, just take another part and just cover it. This is what it should look like when it's done. And it's squishy as well. Now poke two holes at the bottom of the cube for the eyes. For this one, you don't need to glue the eye. If, if you don't want to, I then glue mine because it's just very thin and it's very secure. You can leave the cube like this, but as you know, all my tutorial, I always like to add them some brushes. So I use a very dark red eyeshadow because the color of the brown is quite dark. If you are making different color, you may consider using a lighter eyeshadow, such as pink. I just want the brushes to stand out more, so I'm using a darker brushes. Now my chocolate cube is done. You can definitely use other colors. As you see, this is the one I just showed you. And I also did make a pink one. I also make a white one. The white one actually looks like a marshmallow or a sugar cube. And now I make a blue one. You see how the pink and the blue one is the can cotton candy color? They are so adorable and you can put them in a cup or a boxes as a decoration. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked this tutorial. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel.